go ahead and color the eyes while we're here. And I do not believe I had picked an eye color for Horatio. I think I want him to have a deep brown, just because I've got a love of brown eyed guy. And we're going to go ahead and stick in brown. That's the way to do it. Nice, pretty brown eyes. Mm. A nice highlight. And of course, cover it all up with white so you can't really see anything. That works. Just bright with time. So, yes, I'm sure at this point you're all very bored. So I'm not really doing much. Just coloring. I'm actually concentrating. This is what you people have done to me. I'm concentrating on what I'm doing. That doesn't happen often. On the bright side though, when this ends I'll actually know how long it took to color and sketch this. And since this is probably about the average of a single panel, so you can get a good idea of how much it, prob how much it takes to do a single panel start to finish. Unless of course I'm copy pasting. In which case, it usually goes a lot faster. And some of you are probably wondering why I never use the little wand color tool. I actually sit here and color everything out. Not very time constraining, but it just seems a little more natural to color it by hand, even if I have to go back and find all the little spots I missed. Maybe it's my compromise for never drawing on paper anymore. If you're fun to know, or would like to know, Wham is 100% digital, start to finish. I think a few of the starting comics were drawn on paper first, but it was no more than the first five. No, because the fifth one was digital. The first one was on paper. Rest. And wow, this really feels like talking to myself instead of to a bunch of people. Maybe I'm crazy. Or maybe not. I don't think I was meant to host TV shows, but if any of you find this entertaining in the least, at least I did my job somewhat. Maybe not completely. I wonder if I could keep this up for the full length that it would take to draw in. Actually concentrating, that's at least two to three hours. So, I have to actually come up with something to talk about. But right now, there's not much really. Oh. Yay. He's all colored while I'm at it. I can crop him down. Let's just crop it down even further so we can just get rid of. No, that didn't look very good. There we go. That's a little better. More balanced. And as you can see, I definitely cannot type today. By the way, I love clipping masks. They are my friend. And you're about to see my wonderful shading technique. I read about it in a tutorial once, and I have fell in love with it ever since. Because I can pick one color, and I can shade everything without switching. Or worrying about having to redo anything 
because I can just erase out of the palette. I'm sure some of you knew about it already. But I'm still excited about being able to shade all at once without switching layers or palettes as much as when I first got it. Figured it out. So, here's your lesson. Read tutorials. They are your friends. And you'll notice I drop off usually when I'm actually stopping to pay attention to something that I'm doing. Probably a good tactic. Maybe. I don't know. Some of you probably can't even hear this because I think I'm mumbling at this point. Mumble, mumble, mumble. Ha 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 ha. Mumble. Oh, see, you're just finest. And I lost my boo. I used to get, I got so good at using the stamp tool instead of my palette. But that's okay. Because you can hardly notice the difference. I might pick a different boo. highlight for his hair and of course the hair back here no what's that let's clean up the shading just a little bit And there we go. A very quick Horatio. Let's go ahead and put his name in the corner. Oh, and my favorite font, as all of you know, has been and always will be Comic Sans. When I was very little, that was my favorite font to use. I even typed papers in it. I don't do that anymore, of course, because it's a miserable thought to read for long periods of time in something like a paper, but it works just well for the comic, I think. And there we go. And why not? Just so you know where to go to go see him. Let's do something in the background. Just something plain and simple. I like gradients. Gradients are fun. One, two. There we go. And there we have it. So, thanks for listening to this cute little inane babbling, or whatever it was. Read Wham! You know you want to.